Hey, parents, listen up. This is something all of us have in our medicine cabinets. There has been a recall on infant liquid ibuprofen because it could be too strong. News 19's Jenna Kurzina has more. Like with food poisoning or questionable food, when in doubt, throw it out. If you have it or you know, you're concerned about it, just replace it with something that's going to be safe for your child. Several brands of infant liquid ibuprofen sold at Walmart, CVS, and the Family Dollar have been recalled. This version of medication may contain higher concentration, which could end up leaving your toddler sick. Some side effects could be vomiting, diarrhea, and other stomach-like symptoms. But Director of Palmetto Poison Center, Joe Michael, says some may not have a reaction at all. There's two liquid formulations for infants versus children. The infants has um, 50 milligrams per 1.25 mLs of ibuprofen, and the children's has 100 milligrams per 5 mLs. So if you have the children's, as far as we know, you're okay. That's not part of the recall. Michael says it is important to know what the recall entails, no matter what it is for. Particularly when we're dealing with recently with the children's or the infant's ibuprofen, the concentration is too strong. There's too much drug in it. But sometimes recalls can be um, have have eggs or milk in it when it's not supposed to be in a particular product. So if you know what the recall is, then you know what the potential harm is for you. If you find out you have any of these brands of infant ibuprofen, throw it out and contact your physician or pharmacist. If you pay attention to these things, which we do in our business, uh, there's recalls throughout the year, whether it's medication, whether it's food, and it's safety reasons. Sometimes the manufacturer will be the one who does the recall. Sometimes the FDA will actually pose the recall when they, they're receiving reports of people getting sick or other issues associated with it. In Columbia, Jenna Kurzina, News 19, WLTX. All right, one more time. Those were sold at Walmart, CVS, and Family Dollar. For a complete list, go to WLTX.com.